ready tonight. <laughs> You like that one. Okay, so the reason why we understood that the queen here, why, why did we sacrifice our bishop? Because the queen was defending e7, well, it's still kind of defending. But the queen was also defending the knight on f6. So think about how do you get this knight? It's not so easy. A5, but then the pawn can just capture. Yes, yes. And then you move to g5. Very good, guys. Teamwork. Knight to g5 check. I was thinking about that. That's a he has to take. And now queen to g5 check. And now the king uh, went to, let's see, uh, f8. He takes f6 check. Now remember, if the queen would be on e7, this would not be possible because she would just take our queen. So queen takes f6 check. King G8. No, queen F7. No, queen F7. Okay, queen F7 and King F7, H8. Sorry. G7. That's uh, exactly my God. That would just be a queen's sacrifice. I vote F7. F8. I vote F7. F7. Okay, let's look at F7. If check, then King H8. How would you continue? Uh, E7. Yeah, pretty much he did the same thing, but he just played it immediately. So e7, the idea is just to promote with a checkmate. But don't forget, black also has some chances, some counter chances. So he has to take queen c1 check. Okay. We have only one move, right? Yeah. Now, if we uh, defend with our queen, a queen exchange, is it good for us or is it bad for it's us? Bad, yeah, because he has, he's up very good. Okay. If we exchange, then we are losing. Take, taking king f7, and this pawn is running. Very good, guys. 